You think we're going to beat all these games? Nope. Backlog boys. No, probably not. Hey. Here we are. Uh, we got a full tank of gas, and we're ready to fight yep. these Metroids. Uh, we got full two two full tanks of health. Of health, and I'm gonna. And love and I'm gonna wealth. see if my my ice beam works on him. You can freeze him. Yeah, I mean that. This is okay. There we go. Yeah, it doesn't work. It does not. He makes weird like it, weird, elephant noises. Yeah. I feel like I'm killing a baby elephant. All right, that's one down. Woo! Um, he took less than a whole energy tank away, so that's good. So we could just go straight to another one. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna just grab health from these guys just on the way back, couple. get what I get, um, and then we'll go after the next one. And I feel pretty confident about that one. Yep, two to go in this area. And then we'll probably heal up before the last one just to be safe. Okay. Because we don't want to have to do this again. Nope. Uh, we've already done it many times. <laughs> yeah. Just, we want to make sure that it's only once in this playthrough. So... You see that uh, that thing there? Yeah. Tell, tell us about that. This right here? Yeah. Uh, this is really annoying. Um, <laughs> it's like the carapace of a Metroid. Um, and it like grabs Samus in the weirdest... Sorry, grabs Metroid in the weirdest, <laughs> weirdest physics. And you get like stuck in it. So if you see me going over one of those in what appears to be like a really nonsensical way, it's because it's like really weird to jump in. Um, I'm I'm, I'm going to go ahead and assume that most people haven't played this game because it was on the original Game Boy and the original Metroid and Super Metroid are way more popular and they were the games like on the other either side of this one. Um but yeah, this one's this one's very very strange. Um you can also get a free missile off and he takes damage like as soon as he comes awake. So does he always sit there for like a fixed amount of time once he appears? Yeah, he well he it's it's weird like he doesn't activate until he has like until you're within a certain distance of him. But once he's on the screen, you can still shoot him with the missile. But and just then, once? Just once. Yeah, and okay. it like it like stores the damage. <laughs> so then he like as soon as he comes to life, then he'll take that one hit. Then he takes that one hit of damage like immediately. Huh. Um I was looking up some like speedrun stuff about this game, and they were talking about that. Um, I think it applies to like most enemies in the game, but it's really only like practical to use against the Metroids. Yeah. Um, okay, here's he this is. guy. So yeah, we're gonna <laughs> get our free shot in here. You'll see he like blinks. Mm -hmm. This guy's annoying because he tries to like push you out of the screen. But he's dead. He is dead. Um, you know what this means? This means we are officially farther than we got in our last playthrough. Well, as, well, as long as we make we it to the save as, point. Yeah. We are as, as far. As we can get to the save. So yeah, the screen is shaking again. This means that we've completed area one. Oh no. Um, and we're even. ready to head off to area two, uh, which is where we lost our composure <laughs> mm -hmm. in the last playthrough. Yeah, we died um, en route. Yes, we died en route, and we were like, you know what, we need to... And then we uh, had to redo everything, we had to, pretty much. We had to, yeah, we had to redo all three of those Metroids that we just killed. And it um, was horrible. And we were on what, like, we were probably like seven or ep eight episodes worth? Yeah, probably. In, like, twice yeah. twice what we've done already? I mean, it took, like, another two or three to do that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it was tough. So we decided to get our poop in a group yep. and uh, get get stuff going here. And this is feeling a lot better, I gotta say. Yeah. Um, uh, for me too. I'm feeling good about it. <laughs> it was good for you too. Uh, yeah, because it was pretty stressful <laughs> last time. <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah. I, well, and I just feel like I'm a little bit like better at the game. Yeah. You know, like I, I was literally playing it for the first time, um, cold, and the controls are not, you know, the most native thing in the world to me. You know, having grown up yeah. with Mario and RPGs. Um, I'm not the best at uh, Metroid. And plus, I think because this is the, uh, a Game Boy game, the controls are a, a little bit different than how they were in like Zero Mission, mm -hmm. um, which I actually happened to play on the PSP oh. um, because LOL hacks. <laughs> um, okay. This is the way we want to go. Oh, we should... Well, actually... Okay. 
Are you ready for this? get to hear. Are you ready for this, Vaughn? Oh uh, yeah. Um. So at the beginning of area two, there's a Metroid, and then there's a save point right after. So if we're feeling saucy, we could just go for it. Is there a lot of crap? That's because that's like a. There's no way to know. All right. Um. Where are we relative to the save right now? We are right here. Hmm. We haven't entered area two yet. Hmm. <laughs> I say we go for it. Think so? Yeah, I mean... Well, if you're feeling good. Because, I, I mean, I feel better than we did the last time, but we also made this mistake before. We did make this mistake before. And it really but, came back to bite us. Um, well... But I, you, you were... We, you haven't, were, we haven't run into any, like, regular enemies yet that are, like, super lethal. True. You know? Like, they'll only kill, kill me if I'm, like, complacent. And most of them, you know, can give out energy. So I'm just gonna. We're gonna see. Yeah, I'm just gonna be a little conservative. Okay. And pay attention, and I think we'll be fine. Okay. You know. Well, I trust you. Yeah, I mean, children have completed this game, so. <laughs> um. Now we get our cool music back. Is this harder than Metroid One? Um. Well, the. It might not be harder than the original version of Metroid 1, because Metroid 1 didn't have saving. Okay. Um, you had to use passwords, I think? I think it was a password game? Okay. I don't know. I could be I could be wrong. Maybe there is some way to save, but whenever I played it, I couldn't figure out how to save. Okay. Um, and it's pretty unforgiving. When you die, you go back to the beginning of the game. Okay. Um, That's like uh, Castlevania. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Which is brutal. Yeah, super brutal. Um... All right, I think this is it right here. I think this is where we want to go. But I, pl I played the GBA version, which is a lot okay. easier. Um, it has save points. It has a map. Um, a very, a very... you can open in-game? Yes. Okay. It has a very detailed map. Hmm. Um, you can. It tells you like where like ammo upgrades and health upgrades are, and it tells you where the, the Metroids you're looking for are, um, all that kind of stuff. You know, um, when I was a... A stupid kid. <laughs> I got uh, I got stuck in the in the Deku Palace in uh, Majora's Mask. Oh really? Um, for, and because I don't know what I was doing wrong, but like I, I literally couldn't figure out what to do, even though and I had the guide. Was it like the courtyard part where you're stealthing? It was like oh geez. It was like after that, like it's, once you look at, like you plant a flower somewhere. Mm -hmm. there's, there's one there's one place where you can plant a flower and get a chest. And that's, oh, that's the, the bean sprout. By the bean guy. Yeah. yeah. There's another place where you're supposed to plant a flower that you have to do to advance. Mm -hmm. And the way I was reading... I remember that very specifically because I just did it in the 3DS version. Did you? Yeah. Okay. Um, and the way... Like, for some reason, I thought that it was one plant that had a chest and advanced you through the plot. And I couldn't, and so, so I thought it was just like one plant that you had to plant in one place that would do both of those things. And okay. uh, kid me couldn't uh, <laughs> find another way to do it, so I just uh, gave up. Interesting. And uh, so I feel like I couldn't have beaten games like this <laughs> if I couldn't figure that out. Well, yeah, and you know, that's not even a dungeon. That's just a that's like a mini dungeon. Are these? Just what like... is that? Missile. Well, um, no, it just eats it. Uh, well, you can. That shoot makes me think that I can just stand on it. Well, what about the sponge below you? I yeah. can't shoot the sponge. Should I find out if this damages me, or should I not risk it? Well, you can shoot the sponge. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of cute, isn't it? Is that what is this? What is that sound? You know, you can do. You can go back to like. That's one spot back, and then shoot all of them. Oh, but wait, we need to get up. Yeah. Oh, but wait, the spider ball. Yeah, we're, I don't we're know. good. We're just gonna do this because we're, we're gonna cheese it. This is yeah. I mean, this isn't really cheesing. We're gonna cheese the cheese. Oh, that's right. We we talked about cheesing in the first time we played through this, and now we don't have that anymore. Should we talk about cheesing again? Yeah. Does every do people know what that is? I don't think people know. I feel like that's a pretty self coined term. You think so. Yeah. Okay. Um, well. You heard it here first. I'm just gonna. You heard it here first. Uh, trademark backlog boys. BB. 2016 uh, cheesing um, is is uh, when basically you use less than um, respectable tactics. 
Yes. <laughs> Basically, doing something in a game that's really stupid. Metroid. Um, oh, hey, it's a Metroid. Doing something in a no, game that's, Samus. that's... You're Metroid. Oh, yeah, I'm Metroid, and I'm going to kill this, this Samus, Samus right here. Yes. Um, and a free missile shot. It's actually really good when they're above you. Boom, no damage. Flawless cool. victory. Okay, and there should be a save point really close to here. Um, yeah, we're right here. Yeah, just yeah it should be straight just across straight. Uh, this next area here. And then what we'll Ooh, do new is... enemy. Ooh. Look out. He's dead. Yep, he's dead. Is that was that the, is that the same thing? Newly dead. Uh, yeah. Yeah, there should be a save room here. He was dead on your arrival. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Very nice. All right, save we completed. Saved. We're We've... officially farther in the game uh, than ever before. Than ever before. Uh, we're going to pick it up tomorrow. And you're going to pick it up, right? <laughs> They're going to pick it up with us. We're the backlog boys. And you're going to actually, you're, you're the guest next time. Oh my God. Look forward to that. Yeah.